My final further maths exam is today. And oh my gosh, when I say that my entire, whether I get into uni or not, depends on today. It depends on today. It depends on how I do today. And it's not good, okay? It's not good at all. All right, let me tell you, okay? Further maths paper one was okay. It didn't go too bad, but it didn't go well. It just went okay. So I had to do better on paper two and paper three so that I could get at least an A because that's what I need um, to get into my uni. But then, further maths, further maths paper two, okay? That went so bad, so, so, so bad. Literally, it could not have gone worse. I probably got an average of like a D on that single paper. Genuinely, it could have just ruined my chances of going to uni completely, just that single paper. So now I've got paper three today in the afternoon. Paper three, paper three, this entire time, third maths paper one, paper two have just been pure maths. This is additional maths and I've never had time to properly cover it because I've been revising pure maths. So basically, I've been cramming so, so much yesterday and the day before just for this exam. And it hasn't gone well at all. There's still a massive amount of content that I don't know. And when I say I don't know it, I mean, not, I don't mean I haven't revised it. I mean, I haven't learned it. So it's not looking good at all, but we still got a few hours um, in school to get to school, revise, revise learn content and see where we get because like <sighs> there's not much we can do other than that and we just gotta be good we just we just gotta use our time well and remember anything that we actually learned today so that's that's the dilemma that we're in right now but hopefully it's fine um luckily this is the last further maths exam ever so after this no more further maths and basically just a physics exam and a maths exam, but the maths exam is probably the easiest maths exam, in my opinion. So just after this, things will calm down just a bit, just just a tiny bit. But that physics exam is also really difficult. So that's just a lie. So yeah, I need to go to school. I am technically late. I kind of missed a lesson, but I woke up late because I went to sleep late because I was doing stuff for this exam. But yeah, let's go to school. Love, 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 love. Oh my god. I've got one more one more hour of lessons until the exam. Mm, good luck. Thank you. You're gonna do great. <laughs> I haven't learned a lot of the content. Um it's called discrete maths. And there's discrete maths is half of I know, but like I don't like lifting it up because like people no, 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 it's alright. But like it's just like <laughs> I've got discrete, I'm revising discrete maths and basically, basically, it's half the paper and it's, it's the whole half of the other, it's the whole half of the paper and I only know half the content. Like, think about how many people are going into these exams who aren't doing any revision. Um, further maths students, I don't know about that one. They're pretty, you they're pretty. Know. You know, I was going into the maths exam yesterday. Alright, well, I've got to go to further maths now. Yeah, and bio went well, he was like, apparently. He went well, like, apparently. Like, it went good. So, all the people who do bio paper to uh, Ed Excel. What are you doing? Actually, it was good. It was good. We're about to go into further maths. We got like yeah. literally like two, so rubber, two, three minutes. Do I have a rubber? I used my pencil thing, so I actually. Yeah, but don't. I don't have a rubber. Um, You're wait. such a snake. Wait, 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 wait. wait. I do have a I love our e rubber. Thank you so it's much. The vibes are good. The vibes are good. I. Are you gonna take this? Is horrendous. That's Jack and Rose. It's not mine. Okay. I'm not gonna use it either. I'm not oh, gonna use it. Like you probably did. You were. <laughs> you were. <laughs> um. Maybe. Maybe not. The vlog is seeing how. If no, it's not to, true. If you need it today, you can. I probably don't need it today. I've got so much equipment. Well, I'll you find it. Go. I'll find. Uh, this might not be yours. I've stolen I many. I think that's it. Oh, okay. I believe this guy. Is I would. Uh, I would never. Oh, oh okay. Yeah. No, it's right. Keep it for stats because you might need it. For you pure might need next it. You week. never know. You might need it for pure next week though. Yeah. <laughs>
Ramsey. Yes. Are you ready? I'm so ready. I'm so ready, but I need to go to the toilet before I yeah, don't. I'm not ready. So see ya. Your bun. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Where is Jane? I want my bun back. I think it's in her stomach. All right. Uh, I'll get some more. Uh, somebody eat the bun. The Jane didn't want one, so left it. Oh, actually. Bishop. Yeah, left it for Bishop. <laughs> it's a Bishop. This <laughs> big back yeah, who didn't even show up to the lesson as well. I didn't know we had a lesson. She said it multiple no, times. When I wasn't in the, in the lesson, she said. No, she said it while you were there. What? No, he hasn't been there for like a week. He wasn't. When was the last time you were in the lesson? That's kind of. Um. All right, I need to go to the toilet. Yeah, when I did the stand-up paper, we did it like after. I was like, oh, this is so peaceful. So, so ready. Okay. I, like, literally just like, got taught so multiple different like, topics like what? just yeah. now. No, like, networks. It's really hot, really Jesus. Um, yeah, so, it was great. So, like, if I answer the question, it's like, it's difficult. Yeah, but I don't really know how to draw it. I do, but, like, it's just... Basically... ...to the horribleness of it, but just, like, anything... Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Alright, okay, now what do you th what, how do you think this season is gonna go? Um, we're all getting well, I'm getting cooked. Oh, okay. See, paper one. But you haven't been showing two. up to school, so. Yeah, because. Like, what has that re where's that revision going? I've been busy. There's a lot of One Piece episodes out there. <laughs> I hope you haven't been watching One Piece, so that's really embarrassing. But I just did. I recently caught up. You, you caught up? Yeah. So you haven't been watching One Piece? Oh my god. The overall consensus is that none of like they were all doable, which is not good because I found every single one hard. Yeah, they did kind of like slowly get easier, but at the same time, they were still all hard to me. Is it, where are you going? Get a oh, oh my god, it's bad. No, no, I'm going to buy Was it the second question? I wish it came up as an actual proper question instead of like a not a multiple choice, but it's fine. Yeah, it's just this man. I won't sign out. Okay, now that I'm not outside and in traffic, I don't know. Um, here's the thing about that exam people came out of the exam and they said wow that was so easy people came out and they were like that was a very very easy exam and the thing was these exams for further maths have been getting progressively easier paper one was probably the hardest for a lot of people paper two was a bit easier and this was really easy i came out of this exam and i didn't think it was difficult the thing with me okay this specific exam is split in two discrete maths and statistics statistics i was confident on um i got a stars in it previously and i was confident i could do well on it but the statistics portion of this exam was a bit weirder than other exams it wasn't as straightforward as statistics should be um so i didn't do as well on that part of the exam which is not good but the thing is, on the discrete portion of the exam, usually I do terribly. I am so bad at discrete that I will genuinely just answer one question, leave the rest blank, and I'll get a U on discrete. That's how bad I was at it. And that's why I was cramming it so much the night before. Um, and just in general. Because I was constantly trying to learn content for it and not actually revise it. Because just just that's, that's just how things have decided to go. Um... So, I, but in that exam, the discrete portion, I answered most of the questions. In fact, I basically answered, okay, no, no, I answered most of the questions. I don't think I answered every single question, but I answered most of the questions, and that's not usual for me at all. I usually leave a lot of them blank. So, that could be good. And also, some of the questions I did answer, I was confident on the answers, if I was answering anything in the I'd usually not be confident on the answers, but I was confident on a lot of the answers. And I came out of the exam and some of the answers I discussed, I did actually get. So that was pretty good. That was like, that was a good revelation. Um, but the thing is, because statistics went a bit worse um, than it should have gone, and because discrete is never that good in general, 
Um, so I could have still done pretty bad on that. I can only think that I've done okay on that exam. I can only think that I've done okay, but everyone else has come out of that exam having done great. So what's gonna happen is that the grade boundaries are gonna be really, really high. Um, so here I am having only done okay on paper one, okay on paper three, and really, really bad on paper two, whilst everyone else has done really good on paper one. Um, no. No, actually, most people, yeah, most people that actually did really good on paper one, did really good on paper three, and did a bit worse on paper two. I personally thought paper two was easier than paper one, though. That's why I said that it's been getting progressively easier. But a lot of people will come out easy on paper one, easy on paper three, and a bit harder on paper two. And I'm going to come out with okay on paper one, okay on paper three, and terrible on paper two. The grey boundaries are going to be high. And I... I'm going to be a victim of the great boundaries. So the overall thing about Fly the Maps is this isn't good. Like, it's not good at all. I'm really sweaty, by the way. It's really hard. It's like, this isn't good at all, but it's over. So should I be, think should I be thinking about it? No. There's nothing I can do at this point. There's no point letting it get to me um, and thinking, oh, I'm I'm going to do so bad. Um, even if I do badly in further maths, if I do well in physics, it, um, it's okay. Basically, I can do bad in further maths if I do good in physics. And by bad in further maths, I mean minimum a B. If I get less than a B, I can't go to uni. Um, but the thing is, if I get a B in further maths, I have to get an A in physics, minimum. Um, the thing, it's vice versa. So I can't get a B on both of them. I must get an A and B on them. So if I take this and think, okay, I'm going to get a B in further maths minimum, I have to get an A minimum in physics, which means I need to work hard for the final physics paper, which is on Tuesday, which is in four days, because it's also one of the harder papers, in my opinion. And physics paper, physics paper one was horrendous, and physics paper two was okay. So I need physics paper three to be great so I can think maybe I will get an A, you know? Yeah, and that's how that's how I'm feeling. I think I'm feeling the vibes were really good today only because it was sunny. Year 11s, I think they might have finished their exams, which I'll be making a video on. Um, I think they might have finished their GCSE exams. I'm not sure. They were like all lingering outside and I was like, what's going on? But like they had good vibes about them. Um, and everyone in my class was pretty, pretty giddy. And I was like, okay, you know what? The vibes are good. And that's why I'm just like, and also third mass is over. So that's why I'm just like, you know what? No matter how the papers went or that specific paper, I'm all right. I'm fine. I'm good. I'm chill. And now we just need to prepare for physics paper three and then it'll be over. Finally. So yeah, good stuff. Thank you, AQA, for this paper, I guess. It was easy for a lot of people, so... I don't think AQA tortured any further math students this period of time. Physics, on the other hand, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you.